Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome back to another video. This is your host, Rising Oblivion. Today, guys, we're going to be going over the Persona 25th Times West. So this is basically going to be a more Western merchandise slash event. And keep in mind, they for sure made sure to emphasize this is a merchandise and event news. So um, don't expect anything wild from this. I mean, it's nice that we're getting something for us specifically here for the West, but I imagine this is going to be more dumbed down versions of basically what we have in the Japanese stuff. The Japanese stuff, of course, they're getting so much more like concerts and stuff like that. And the people in the West maybe were upset about that. I've seen, you know, plenty of people on Twitter talking about it. And of course, we don't get the concerts and stuff like that. So we just kind of have to deal with what's left over. And a lot of that is merchandise and just random events that might potentially happen like persona au coming to steam and everywhere else so let's see what we have today let's see how things are going let's, let's check in the persona 25th anniversary times west i guess that's what we got here <laughs> so okay it's morgana and teddy okay well that's persona good times west. it is nice that we're getting it in english we don't have to worry about not understanding 100% what everything means. So. Hello, oh, the song's not copyrighted. It's me, the mastermind behind the Phantom Thieves, Morgana. And me, the uh. one and only Bear Yudi of the investigation team, Teddy! We're here to bring some exciting oh, God. anniversary related news about upcoming events and merchandise for fans all around the world. Merch. <laughs> Just what we asked for. So right? Let's get on with the show! Super Mascot Team Up, go! Hey, oh my god. I'm no mascot. That was weird. Get ready to groove! Persona Super Live Peace Sound Wish 2022 is coming up this October. It's a one-of-a-kind musical extravaganza with a full orchestra performing songs from across the Persona It's just Japan though, right? And streaming tickets will be available worldwide. Oh, streaming tickets, so that's right. That's right, I forgot about that. Get it? Get and and like we've a lot of people have talked about before, this is actually interesting. A lot of times during the end of these concerts, they've released games before. Well, not released them, but they've had trailers talking about games that are going to be releasing and whatnot. We have seen this, I believe for Persona Q we've seen this. I think Royal potentially was something else too. I can't remember exactly, but we've had multiple things actually be presented to us and brought into our attention because of these events. So we could see an event trailer for this stuff. So streaming this might be good to also just get some news at the end. Don't take that for 100% that there will be something, but there could be. There could be. special illustration for the event too. Who knows? Everyone is looking so cool. I, I love this art. I really do love this art. Uh, what's next? The Persona 25th anniversary is coming to Anime Oh, Anime Expo. Make sure to stop by the Sega booth for a special photo opportunity. Photo? Oh. Oh my god. Hit Teddy Socks? If I catch anybody wearing these fucking teddy socks, I don't know what to do, man. I don't know what to do, man. I don't know what to do, man. You are not well adjusted to society if you're wearing those fucking teddy socks. I'm gonna say it now. I'm sorry. I'm sure they're just saving the best for the grand finale. I don't like Morgana's smile. These products and more will be available at Shop Atlas too. Oh man. And our Anime Expo celebration wouldn't be complete without a Persona party! Midnight Masquerade? Ooh! Persona is taking over Lounge 21 on July 2nd for a Midnight Masquerade. That's actually, that's like, actually kind of cool. So I'm pretty sure Anime Expo's in LA, so if you're interested. If you're around LA, I mean... You're a big Persona fan, I guess this is probably right up your alley then, huh? We've got a special collaboration in the works with Shake Ramen too, so we can get some tasty food while we're there. I never heard of Shake Ramen. Oh, sounds tasty. 
Looks like Anime Expo is shaping up to be tons of fun this year. And Mystery Badge collect all seven so designs. Times West. Whew, that was a lot of info. Well, that's all for. Hey, hang on a second. We aren't done yet. There's still plenty <laughs> more news to share. I hope. <laughs> I hope there's more. Teddy's gotta go be a pervert real fast, Morgana, alright? You don't know him like we do. The Quantum Cafe. Cafe is hosting a special Persona 25th anniversary cafe event all this June. Visit Requiem Cafe in Anaheim from June 1st to June 30th to try the Persona themed menu of drinks and snacks. Or even to take a photo in the Velvet Room. A whole collection of exclusive items will also be available. So be sure to Am I the only one that doesn't think these t-shirts and stuff look that cool? That mug actually looks decent, but these t-shirts and stuff, I'm sorry. They're just not, it's not doing it for me. I thought Teddy fucking left. Why is he back? made piping guides for characters from Persona 4 and Persona 5, so you can make our special macarons at home. I mean, those look cute. I'll give them that. Everyone looks good enough to eat. I can oh, shut up, Teddy. Stop, Teddy, stop. We're almost out of time. Let's keep the ball rolling. What else can we announce? There's lots more Persona 25th merch coming to shop at- These shirts in particular- Okay, so these were leaked beforehand. Guys. Yo. What the fuck? These t-shirts suck. I'm gonna say it straight. I love Atlas. I love Persona. Don't get me wrong. It's one of these stylish, like, most stylish franchises. I think just not even games just ever. Dude, these t-shirts- Come on. Are we for real with ourselves? And by the way, you can get them bundled together, all five, for $100. Dude. Come on. These t-shirts are bad. It's even, like, it's weird. It's, like, a small text. It's not even, like, fitting the whole front of the shirt or nothing. It's, like, the low, like the upper, like, fourth. It's so bad, dude. I'm sorry. These t-shirts are not good. I'm sorry, dude. These shirts are styled after each of the schools featured in the Persona series. It'd be a, it's a cool concept on paper, but the way they executed it. Ugh. Right now. Yeah, go ahead, all three people who want that. These look better. Oh, the vinyl set. Wow, that's right. They're super expensive. I forgot. But this might not be bad, because genuinely, Persona has just good music, so that's not bad. Uh, P5 Collection, that's not too bad. The long sleeve, see what I mean, like, how stylish, like, at least the characters and stuff look like on these posters and things? And how plain these shirts look? Dude, I can't, I just can't. It's our Coin X Persona Generated Collection P1-5 hoodies. Even this will look better, like, see how stylish this already kind of looks, just with the characters on the front? These look really cool. I would definitely get this. Sucks that the hoodie's in the summer. I guess, <laughs> you know, you're waiting to get that later in the year. But still, pretty cool. Like, even this, like, jacket looks cooler. I don't know. Maybe they meant for them to be, like, cheaper t-shirts. I don't know. Maybe I'm being a little negative. Look how cozy those hoodies look. I think that collector's jacket is calling my name. And pre-orders are still available what? for Persona 25th Anniversary Deluxe Vinyl Box Set 2! It includes music from all across the Persona series! And what better way to play your Persona vinyl than on a super stylish new Persona turntable! Yeah, this was leaked as well. $500 though? Ooh! Um... Yeah, I don't know about that, guys. I really don't. I mean, I think the U-Turn Audio, I think that is actually, like, a very good brand. I know acrylic is also good for vinyl stuff as well, but I don't know about this. I don't know. The U-Turn Audio P25th Anniversary Vinyl Player is available. 
I mean, at least it looks cool. Like, this is a cool design. You also have, like, the years here for, like, the games and stuff. I mean, it does look pretty nice, but I just don't know if it's worth $500. Built-in preamp. A lot of the amps built into this type of stuff are not very good. I don't know if it's worth 500 Well, I think that's everything. Great job, us. Oh, they're ending it with a banger in the song. Background. Aw, does someone need a cat nap? Yes. Uh, of course not. I'm wide awake. Why don't you run off and hibernate or something? Good oh my god. Good Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye bye. Hey. Oh man. Thanks for watching. Just real quick at the end, like, P6. <laughs> okay, well, I mean... Uh... <laughs> uh... There it is, folks. I think some of these t-shirts, the ones they showed are bad. The hoodies? Now, the hoodies, on the other hand. Hell yeah, bro. That's what I'm talking about. Those hoodies look sick as fuck. I'd buy some of those hoodies. Those t-shirts, I can't do. Some of that stuff is just overpriced. Like I said, I love Atlas. But Persona is so stylish. It has so much character to it, man. Those plain t-shirts just really do. They're not doing it. They're not doing it. If you want to get a hold of it, quickly go to the Atlas's merch website and get them. Because it sounds like, you know, from what this video is saying, they're available now. Um, I think the record player might have been available now as well. Um, the deluxe set of all the vinyls... Uh, like $400. Like I said, that's pretty expensive, but it seems like there's multiple vinyls per game. So, at the end of the day, that might actually add up. And just for how good Persona's music is, I think that does add up at the end when it comes to all those vinyls. So, that price probably isn't too ridiculous considering how much you get in it. Um, like I said, it's like multiple vinyls per thing. I think only P1 has one vinyl, but the rest of them have multiple vinyls uh per you know thing like i was saying per game so you are getting a decent amount out of that so that might be worth it the vinyl player of course that does accompany it pretty well that would be very nice to have all together that definitely is like a big collector's item in terms of novelty it's good in terms of usability I, i'm not exactly too sure vinyl players are you know kind of hard to judge exactly if they're super good without just playing it and hearing it first, so you got to wait and see. I think that's it for this video, guys. Like, comment, subscribe for more content. Let me know, did you like this Persona 25th West? At least that we're on is to put merchandise and event news in there, and it's in English. It is nice to have this. I really have this than not have this. It is nice that the West is getting a little bit of love. Um, maybe they took into attention some of the stuff that um, had been happening with, you know, the surveys. I don't know if you guys have seen the surveys, but Atlas did big surveys asking people about stuff, you know, how they wanted things to go forward with the West and in terms of like covering news and things like that. And maybe this was one of the things that they decided to, you know, go ahead and take care of and start doing a series where it's for the West specifically. So this is nice. Like I said, I rather have this than not have this, but it is just merged and stuff like that. So expectations should be set to that level. Uh, I know I was kind of negative in this video just because I knew it was going to be merch and stuff, but overall the stuff does look pretty cool, but I don't think I personally would get it. Let me know if there's anything here that you want to get or have already gotten or pre-ordered, so let me know down in the comment section below. Like, comment, subscribe for more content. As always, I'll see you in the next video. Thank you all so much for watching.